Um, I I went. I'm not. I'm not proud of it, but I, I went. It's it's there. How you doing, man? I'm doing well. You're not live yet, but it's supposed uh, I, to be live. I, I, I click. I click in the back. It's red. Hey, it's we're live good. on Twitch. <sighs> and not live on YouTube yet. Thanks. Thanks, Country Bumpkin. He sent me a, a really kind message that says, if you're streaming in a hotel Wi-Fi, uh, I'm praying for you. I'm not. <laughs> We're good. Um, okay. <laughs> Twitch is live still. I don't see anything on YouTube as of yet. Is it not? Let's double check. I'm going to refresh. There we go. It's live now. Good, good, good. All right, cool. I'm not. I can't look at the the chat. So y'all got. Right, we just made. Out. I just made sure you're. Li- we were live on YouTube. We got live on Twitch. We're live everywhere. It needs to be live. Facebook. I'm assuming is live. I don't have it up. Um, uh, welcome in, guys. You can see we're doing the farm sim show. Clutch is normal. Uh, we just did the uh, the members pre stream and um, well, DJ joined us, but um, he's in a car. Uh, no, I'm in a truck. It's different. See, you should and have been in your car if you were in your like with the top down with the car. I think that would have been kind of a fun way to do it. I got to reach over and cut the air conditioner on because it's hot back here. <laughs> uh, it, it, are you in the back seat? I'm in, in the back seat. I tried sitting in the front seat. And number one, the windows are not tinted up there, so it looks weird. And never mind, there's people going by looking at me. We're good. It's fine. In the back seat of your car by yourself. I'm in, I'm in the shut up. <laughs> I'm 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 a hundred percent in the back seat of my my vehicle right now. <laughs> well, right, I'm, I'm using using the new laptop that I talked about last week, so it's coming well, in. Well, you handy. got some use out of it. I mean, you you're, you're buying yeah. toys and making use out of it. I I mean, I support they're that. Not, they're, they're not toys. Yep, they're, they're, they're tools. Man, they're toys. Come on. come on, who are you kidding? Uh, uh, anyway, so the Wi-Fi sucks in there, um, and I don't know where I'm in the middle of nowhere. For this music festival uh, that I used to help run, but I'm not doing it anymore. But they still brought me back to hang out. I was like, "Cool, gets me away for a weekend." But it it's in the middle of nowhere. Like, I should have known when I went in the lobby to sign in a couple, like, what was it thirty minutes ago? And it said Wi-Fi password, no password. Oh boy, I should have known. They're not trying to keep people out of the the the. the there is none. And you weren't listening. <laughs> I don't know. Ask the dude above you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. Anyway, so I'm in my truck today, so I don't have like a couple different screens set up. I was gonna have two laptops, an extra iPad with the monitor with the black. Nope. You get me in the back of a truck. <laughs> well, it's gonna make things a little bit easier. So um music festival, okay. Um Perfect. Yep. A uh, little, blue, little small bluegrass music festival that I used to help run sound and lighting for. Yeah. Um, I used to run sound for the band all the time in like Charlotte, North Carolina, places like that. Um, and this is the first time they're doing the festival since I did the festival. <laughs> and I told them I wasn't doing it anymore in 2020. Well, that never happened. Now you're in the back of a car um, doing a farm sim podcast. Man, I liked it better the other way. <laughs> I think I think you made a poor decision. <laughs> <I'm just saying. laughs> made a bad decision. Poor decisions. Uh, so welcome in, folks. The Farm Sim Show. Um, what what do we do on this, DJ? Uh, well, we're not we're not doing whatever's in the Google Doc. We're going to do this for about five minutes, and I'm going to get out of here. I thought. Do we play the game or something about that? I don't know. There's something. What kind of, what kind of what game are we playing? <laughs> Wait. Where, where am I, DJ? You know what? Read read the screen. All right, I'm not happy about it. You might not be happy about it. <laughs> I'm super All happy right. about this. This is fun. <laughs> why? Why? Do, no, I'm in a GMC Sierra. It's different. Don't you don't you put an F in front of it? Yeah. <laughs> By the way, you've never you've never heard that expression that I sent you on the the messenger. Never. Really? That's, never. That's the first one I've time I've heard that one. Well, you have to use that at work now. <laughs> I might have to. It's, I mean, I've heard different. like t- t- I, we can't say it in chat, but I mean, I've heard <laughs> similar sayings that are close to that, but not in that order. Anyways, it's all good. What other? Just putting them in other orders. They don't sound good in any way. <laughs> okay. You know well, what? You know what? I got an idea. 
Roll the intro, baby. Let's go. I'm in a truck. Are you sure you're ready for this? I'm not. Just do it, man. Come on. <laughs> oh, no. Wrong person. The uh, wrong screen. <laughs> you did that on purpose, is what you did. Um, yeah, I, I, that I take no responsibility. <laughs> Country pumpkin in here with that old star Wi Fi. It's funny that he sent, a, sent me a text message like, what, three, four minutes before I went live? I was like, you have no idea, dude. You're about to see it. <laughs> Let's, um, Let's talk about something that's real and dear to my heart. Welcome to the Fabson Show, everybody. We don't play the game, but we talk about it in a truck. Let's, Dude, that's uh, what I was let's... trying to get you to say, but you didn't say it. You didn't. You didn't say yeah. the thing you're supposed to say. I was gonna put it off and do it now. Uh, anyway, I'm not saying I forgot, but I did remember just now. Um, yo, something happened this week, and it had nothing to do with what's going on right now in my world. Okay. Um, this, no, did you get a girlfriend? This, no. <laughs> No, we far away from that. If we're past <laughs> that point, I think at this point, I, th- I think I should just give up. No, what, hap- what ha- happened was, what there, was happened? No, there was no news. None. It was no pretty quiet week. Well, time. nothing happened. How? Um, nothing happened. Um, stop. All right. Oh. There's, there's something that might have happened. What happened? There's something that definitely might have happened. Where have you been? I could- uh, like maybe a certain anticipated map came out and then and then didn't yeah oh and I got there's there's some interesting information about another map that happened the next day um, with Welker I'm you know I'm I, I thought I knew what had happened but evidently that's not what had happened and <laughs> And but I didn't I didn't have I didn't have the guts to ask what had happened because I felt like it wasn't my place the way it was answered. Uh, <laughs> okay. Uh, and and same thing with the other map that came out. Uh, actually, the creator of the Farming Simulator 19 version of Suznopka GTX made a comment about this. I gotta use my stupid phone for. All okay, this what map today. are we talking about? Can I share my screen on my phone? Um. I can share screens yeah. if you need to. But I don't know how to do this. Is, is there a way I could just like mirror my screen onto my computer, but then my computer shares it? I don't think that's it. It's no. not really a thing that's going to be very quick to set up. Oh, I hang mean... on. Screen mirroring, MacBook. I'm, fr- I'm afraid to touch it because I feel like this will just go away. I'm just not going to do it. All right. Um, <laughs> it, anyway. <laughs> Today is a day, man. Today is a day. Um, the, the, I don't know if I can read out this entire thing or not. But Marcel's in here. Maybe he has some some stuff about it uh, or whatnot. Anyway, yep. GTX uh, made a comment and said that it was disappointing to see a map just converted of his from 19, even though some things had been removed. Uh, the author had asked first, and um, uh, they could have advised that this version of Sosnosco is very special and uh, probably would have said no. Um, they say they've got big plans for mods that they're doing in 22. They say obviously there's no problems if someone converts from FS17, but if they convert from other people's without telling them, that's a different story. Um, they say with that being said, it's upsetting, especially at this time. Please do not uh, show any hate towards the other author as we all make mistakes. So, nice way to end it. Um Puma 145 doesn't do that, though. They have a really good reputation. So you got really me on confused. that one. I'm really confused. This is We were talking about this in pre-stream, actually, with... Um, I've been noticing a few other mods on some of the third-party sites that have just been updated from 19 to 22. And I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure that they don't have the um, the authority from the original authors to do that. And I mean, it's a third-party site. Yeah, I get it. That some stuff gets updated at times, but we're talking mod hub stuff here. It's a little bit more formal. Yeah, but you know, PC players doing it and releasing on third-party sites, it sucks. But there's really not a whole lot of people to do about it. When no. it gets to the mod hub level, that's kind of like peak performance level. 
Yeah, exactly. And, and there's a certain you're... expectation that you've right. got your ducks in a row and you have all the uh, the all your your T's are crossed, your eyes are dotted, and things are good to go with that. And you talk to the right people when you're releasing this stuff. To, you have the you have the the ownership to uh, to use those models or the maps or whatever it might be. Right? You have the authority to do it. Um, I know we've had a lot of talk about that on some other maps that are not going to be coming to 22 um, that we would love to see, but unfortunately have been decided not to come. Yeah. But it is what it is because that's it's your intellectual property. So yeah, you got to respect that, right? Yeah. Um, what, is, what is that? Brian sent a super sticker. Number one. Yeah. yeah. But it doesn't show up on there. there. Yeah, I wish it did. That'd be super cool. It just says. I agree. No, it just says super sticker. Um, okay, what about could we talk about Welkers though? Yeah, um, man, I thought I thought Welkers was gonna be pretty good. Um, and then it was removed like immediately. I know there were some problems. The funny thing is, like, I've had the map for a month and a half, yeah, it's a solid little while, and I didn't experience any of these problems. However, the map, map wasn't done yet either. And instead of testing the map to see if it was broken or if there's anything going on with it. I was tasked with certain things to do. Fair enough. I mean, uh, we've been messing with it a little bit. We ran into a couple of little bugs when I've been playing with it. And mm -hmm. uh, we did it all live. And we all managed, I mean, with the help of chat, we got through some of the bugs, found workarounds for all of them so far. I don't know. I'm I'm disappointed it's left. I just I just I don't want this to become a thing again. This is this is millennial 2.0 all over again. <laughs> DJ, you know, let him go. <laughs> It does look like he's in the back of a golf cart, doesn't it? Get the hashtag going, my man. Um, yeah, it, it, it. There's there's definitely some deja vu going on. So I I don't know what to uh, I I don't know what to think of this. I don't know if there's better ways we can help modders test stuff out. I don't know what other options there are here on this stuff, but. When it's consistency, what happens again? Like two maps in a row like this um, that are. It just it just sucks. That's all, and it uh, it just feels yeah. like it's happening all over again, and I don't like that. So, anyways, yeah. it is what it is. Uh, and but the the thing is, like we we want to see the. I mean, come on, it's Walker Farm. Yeah. We all want to see it. We all want to play it. I don't care if it's broken. Let me play. <laughs> if if I crash my my Xbox, it's on me, man. Just let me play. I know. Just let let me be. Let me have it. Right. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Um. So I know there's a lot of PC players I've talked to said they haven't had any problems. I don't know about console players. How many have had problems with it? I know some people have talked about the uh, the gold, uh, the the safe. Uh, it there is a little sweet spot. You have to hit it just right. Uh, yeah. they, the way they did it, there was only like one way to get it to work correctly. Because um, that was one of the things that I did. It was funny because when we were testing that, I think there's like four or five signs that you have to go to around yeah. the map. And I found the third one first. I found the I gold. Just... I found I hit. I found the gold by accident first. Because <laughs> I had you my menu this, up, like, and I'm like, like, "Oh, what's going? this?" Anyways, um, but I think the signs were there's a there's a bug with the signs too because we can't find number one. The one was supposed to be on the main farm. It's not there. Yeah. Okay. So that's what I thought as well. So um, I. I... I got a lot. I got some. I got more questions than I got answers on that map right now. To be yeah. perfectly honest, it's unfortunate. It's. It sounds like the good thing is that everybody wants to see it. They want it to be good, um, and they're ready to play on it. It doesn't seem like there's a lot of negativity towards it, which is nice. So, and maybe that's one of the reasons it was removed was to, to kind of keep any of that from happening. Regardless, it's Walker. We're really excited to see it. We're really excited to play on it. Yeah, I mean, um, it's. Probably one of the more requested maps, of course, in Farm Sim, simply because of who, who where that channel's gone from Welker, Welker Farms itself. Of course, everyone wants to see that in Millennial. Um, and hopefully, uh, hopefully it gets resolved quickly. I'm just, I'm a real nervous. I remember, I remember when this happened with Millennial and Mappers right. Paradise. It was the same thing, and it's like, oh, it'll be like a week or two, and it took like two months, three months, right? Like it was a it long was time. Months, yeah. yeah, it was a little while. So hopefully this is easier to get resolved, whatever the exact issues are, which I don't know. Anyways, hopefully like next week we see it out again. Anyways, uh, no problems on PS4, Jake San. See, I, I know there have been people had issues. I mean, we had issues with one one field in the live stream where we were trying to direct drill into it and it wouldn't plant into a field until we actually went in and plowed or cultivated it. And as soon as we did that, it was yeah. fine. It was weird. Yeah, that is weird. Uh 
trying to come up with like a reason for that. Maybe just the the way of the way the field was before Could anything, be. and then yeah, I am. <laughs> like I, I haven't I haven't tested this fully through yet. So this it's one of the main fields you start with in new farmer mode. So everyone's gonna run could run into that issue, I guess. Uh, I'm curious to see what happens once you harvest and then go to replant. If it if it's the same thing, As again, you, usually that kind of resets stuff. It should, right? Let's see. So we'll see. Well, I, I'm, I'll probably mess around and get to that point because we're pretty much there now, anyways. So yeah. we'll have to wait and see, I guess. But uh, anyways, fingers crossed. Um, there you go. I get to redo my entire. Stone Valley gameplay, <laughs> but he changed so much. I'm playing the update. I was like, ah, oh, it'll be fine. I'm not gonna have too much to update. <laughs> he changed a lot in the past three weeks. I went and looked at that briefly. I'm like, no, I made I made sure I killed on the, the the original one because I have a game save on that right now. Yeah, I'm like I can't I'm, use this. <laughs> I got I got through Sunday's video, and it, there may not even be a video Monday. If there is, I may just stream it and be like look i gotta like i got so much work to do on this map <laughs> <laughs> and it's not gonna make for great video content but maybe it'll maybe it'll make for good live stream you know fair enough uh, i don't know but what i do know is that i'm in a truck dj in a truck not a car not a police car not Are a van sure? i didn't get kidnapped uh here let me bring up these top stories you got you posted for me because you were, you were say, good we, before we, you got we, we, yeah, after the farm sim show or after farm sim news this morning, I was like, I gotta do this now because Clutch probably won't do it. <laughs> Clutch was not gonna do it at all. Clutch was just waking up because he uh, he was playing American Truck Sim last night really late. Yeah, so you started like mid afternoon my time, and you just kept going. Yeah, we did like six, seven hours, something like that. By the time it was said and done, it was fun though. I mean, they got new maps, right? Okay. Um, uh, you're, you're, you're gonna have to screen share this. I'm stuff. going to. I'm doing it right now. I'm looking for it. I'm just looking here. I'm just because I was looking for the cranes, and I think this is the only pictures we have of it. So I'll bring it up. Well, well uh, there's screen. quite a few. Yeah, you got to go down the, the list a little bit. There's there's some, and then there's some more down there, and there's some stiff. Yeah. yeah. So Ooh, I know really? nothing about these. These look pretty cool, though. Yeah. Uh, so if you've been following it for uh, with the truck and not a car, Marcel. <laughs> You you see you you see him in chat and and he's like is he like does he just mess with people for fun and it's funny because I had a twenty four minute video coming out tomorrow and he looks like a really good guy he's a lot of fun in real life but he he gets him in the chat <laughs> <laughs> uh, it, anyway so yeah uh, so the crane he he teased the crane a couple weeks ago I think before I left. Yep. And then we didn't see anything until I'd already left. And then he said he's going to do the Lizard Cranes is like the branding on it or something like that. And yeah, we we're like, well, okay, well, this is great, but you use these with with containers, like 50-foot like 50 containers. Why, why we don't have those in Farming Simulator? And people were asking that. And he's like, well, see, I got you there because I'm doing those too. And he's made custom trailers. He's got a twenty foot, a twenty five foot, and a fifty foot, um, well, and a forty foot, I guess. Maybe not a fifty. Maybe it's a forty. Uh, you can see 40s, right. But anyways, yeah. Uh, but uh, yeah, he's he's doing it. You got custom uh, colors on it, logos on it. Basically, it's just a tipper. And you he's got a semi truck version of it. If you check the, his most recent post as well, it's cool. Yeah. It's really cool. Where did I see uh, that? There it is. Yeah, yeah. So he uh, here he kind of showcases it as a semi truck. Yeah. Look at that. That's got some reach on it. I wonder how much that's gonna hold. Like, how much would that hold? And like, would that be would that be more than any of the stuff we have in game right now? No, I that's, mean, that's it, legit. So it's only it's only a forty foot, right? So David. Yeah, that's a good point. David's is fifty three foot, and yeah. I think it holds what eighty two thousand liters. So. Uh, but that's for a reason. Um, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I would I would suspect this will probably hold somewhere between I don't know I think forty five to sixty five thousand liters is a good estimate to start with. Um, Fair enough. I, I, I'm, I'm excited to see it. I think it's gonna be cool. It's uh, like for especially when you do root crops. <laughs> like, like he has the spuds in that one. I'm like, okay, yeah. never mind. I can see where this is going now. Um, Fair enough. Yeah. 
Sam. Uh, cool. What do we got? Oh, the challenger. Where is that? There she is. Boom. And kaboom. Custom Modding's Challenger MT 800 series. Yeah. So they've showed this off twice now. Once was last week, week and a half ago, something like that. Is that a week so, and a half? That's it. There it dude, is. Yeah. It's so funny watching people drive by trying to figure out where their room is. It's weird because <laughs> all the all the even numbers are on the other side of the building and all the odds are over here instead of just going, you know, counting from one like normal people do. <laughs> weird. Yeah, see, if you had your Miata, you'd have you have Wi-Fi in the Miata, don't you? <laughs> what happened was no. <laughs> no, actually, I was gonna bring it, but there's uh, they're calling for rain, so the trip today is the only tr the only trip that I'm like the little drivey drive part that I've got. There's no rain; everything has rain. My car sucks in the rain. Anyway, you can adopt this, a DJ for ten bucks a month. <laughs> they're they are absolutely destroying me in the comments, and it's so oh, yeah. funny. They, yeah, I'm not saying keep it up, but. <laughs> anyway, um, now this this is <laughs> you should have used the Miata Wi-Fi. <laughs> well, you just didn't want me to be here. I see how it is. <laughs> uh, anyway, this this is really cool. It's still in early development. Um, I know that Sid Monning's also working on uh, Challenger series. The Dams. So it's, it's cool. They're what a detail that custom goes into some of their stuff. Like, like okay, this. You'd be like, okay, yeah, yeah, like all these. Everyone does a fair amount of detail on these consoles now. But look like at the seats, like yeah, even this. Like I said that in my video this morning. I was like, even the stupid seats, they're they're doing detail on. Why? Yeah. Because he can, and he's good at it. Yeah, it's great. Yeah, no, it makes me laugh. It's like, yeah, the the detail. Like you think, okay, it's the tractor. You might have some detail on the wheel and your gauge cluster and your your console, but let's 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 not go overkill. And you look at the back of the seat, and there's. You got proper folds and like rubber uh, blends in nicely with this. Like, holy crap, man. Come on. You're killing me here. The amount of details ridiculous. Uh, what else you got? Oh, hang on. Oh, la, 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 la. You even put them in Bitly. No, you didn't. Never mind. I was going to say that would have been really handy if you would have put them in Bitly format. Which I did. On some of them, not all. Oh, yeah. Not all of them. Yeah. Some of them are, uh, some of them are just are... Facebook page stuff. Yeah. I try to go quickly. Uh, everybody's freaking out about the, the 32 or 320. So here you go. It exists in what's well, with giants and it's in stage one testing today. I guess. That's, that's about it. And then they're doing this. I just, little, I'm, uh, the and basically, mat. what are you going to do with this? I don't know. Just carry that mat around. <laughs> 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 All right. Fair enough. I'm just, like without terraforming, I'm like, ah, if I if, if everybody had terraforming, then I'd be like, okay, that's that's this is cool. Right. Without, without terraforming, I'm I'm a little um I'm a little confused. I don't know what to do with it. it I don't know what to do with my cool. hands. It's it's cool. Oh yeah, by the way, look at this really cool cup that Giants gave me. Like uh, everybody, everybody where did you get that, that from again? I got this from Erlangen. Yeah. I brought it and I brought yeah. it back. Where was that? Yeah, it was over in it was overseas, right? Yeah, I was in Europe. Hey, you you were over there doing something, weren't you? I was. Yeah. That's cool. Well, that's cool. Some of us did that. That's fun. Thanks, man. Oh, <laughs> I see what's going on. He's jelly. I understand. <laughs> so you got to hang out with Kubota. How cool is that? I, I did, true. This is, hey, you know what? Kubota jumped in the stream the other night. That was kind of fun. The social media manager jumped in and came and threw down a $5 dono and, uh, and hung out in the stream for a bit. You know, you know who doesn't? Oh man, this dude's gonna park way too. Ah, oh, he's got a Virginia tag as well. Save me. Um, <laughs> um, you know, you know who else doesn't get in my chats? Volvo. Come on, man, jump in my chat. I miss you guys. You know who is here? All who? these people. Oh, really? They're over there. At, well, for us, they're up there. Which, Actually, which, like up which, there, technically. Oh, okay. People are looking at me weird. Dude, turn your camera around. Let's look at them. <laughs> I don't think that's a good idea. <laughs> that, that, that dude, it, it is 356 and he is open carrying with pride. <laughs> he's, he's got him a drink as well. <laughs> I'm a little jealous, though. Uh, anyway. Uh, you want to talk about the modular BGA? 
yeah, it's happening. Pretty cool. Pastor's doing a really good job with it. He talked about this a little while ago. Um, yep. Yep. 21, modular. Yep. 21 stuff. I started to use Google Translate to translate the words at the bottom. And some of them, I, I'm not sure if this is German or not. We'll just put it that way. Uh, I think it is. I'm not sure. You got me. It's, I have no clue. It's cool. It's really cool because Caster's taken the BGA and made it completely modular. So if there's parts that you want, you can use those parts. If like you don't use electric or electricity, you don't need it. Yeah. You just don't put that part down, and it doesn't make it. So you're only using the stuff that you want to. It's kind of nice. Plus, I'm curious think it's to see be... what percentage of people are using BGAs in 22. It feels like less BGAs seem like they're. The, the, they seem like they're yesterday farm sim. It seems like it's not Today as much of a thing sim. anymore. Is that is that something that yesterday Clutch would say? Or <laughs> uh, definitely yesterday. It wouldn't be tomorrow. Clutch would say that, but definitely okay. yesterday. I'm just saying. What I'm just saying is, is <laughs> no, no. What I'm just saying is oh, that, what, what you just say. Okay, I see what you're saying. Is that that's not something like with the productions now? It's not something we we do. Like I, I don't know. Like the BGA, I remember in like Farm some 15, Farm some 17, it's like, well, the last thing, if you got a BGA, that's that's your focus. Mm -hmm. And now with productions, it's like, well, there's other things you can go to your last thing now. You don't have to worry about the BGAs to, to get your big moneymaker now. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. And it, and it seems like the BGA is not a big moneymaker. Yeah, and, that's, uh, that's the other thing, right? So, I agree. Um, does it work with the current modular BGA? Yep. Well, it should because he made both of them <laughs> better. <laughs> it's better, yeah. Uh, what I'll be interested in is if it works with the pumps and hoses BGA because that's a modular BGA as well. So it'll be interesting. It'll be kind of interesting. Um, oh yeah, the, the thing that Kim Kim did. So Yo Smotting sent me over information on this, Yos. and I gotta be honest with you. So there, I think I included the second link right below that. If you want to check that out and just show it to people i don't know you ever you ever been in fourth grade and you do chemistry but like it's like dumbed down chemistry like what happens when you put water in flour not like oh you know here's here's how you take enzymes and you pour petrol on them and then you make rocks or something i don't i don't know how it works man i'm, I'm not gonna say i failed a class in high school but science could have been one of them um if i did um let's just move on yep these are these are all things that are, are real things in real life um, and you can read more about it because I put it in the description. Yeah, don't know how that works. What is all this? I, I to me it seems like it's electrical hydraulics. What but is it, all this? There's, but there's no way. <laughs> also, what's up, Richard? Good to see you, man. I was creeping on your shirt. Is anybody <laughs> else as confused as I am? Holy crap! This is all sort. <laughs> I don't. I'm not, man. I don't know what it is. <laughs> but it's real it exists but what does it do <laughs> i don't i don't know it's it's very 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 um um like it's a communication corporate. protocol for tractors and electronics it's a corporate talk it's it doesn't say anything <laughs> <laughs> have you ever seen that like test video that guy did with no. the flux and fibrillator and 3000 or whatever it was called Okay. This guy has just goes on like a he just goes through like a bunch of made up words, but it's like it looks like it's an actual tech demonstration of this piece of equipment, and uh -huh. he just sits there and talks. Like, this is what it feels like to me. If if anyone knows what I'm talking about, uh -huh. I can't remember what the name of that thing is, but it's like yeah, the Flux Incubator Three Thousand or something like that. And he goes through <laughs> with a straight face for like seven minutes and tries to describe this thing. And you're like, what is he talking about? It's like a made up thing the whole time. Oh, God. This is anyway, what this feels like to me. Uh, the the. The thingy, this, this this thing over here, uh, the good thing is there's people that understand it, and they are pumped right now. And I, we don't. <laughs> and I don't, I don't understand it, but but it's cool, like, right? Like, you don't understand something, but it exists. You're like, wow, that's awesome. How yeah, I need to read up on this, Yoss. I need to read up through this some more. It's Yoss. I made a video on that. Is it Yoss? Is it Yoss? Yoss? No, it's Yoss. He just always and wants then... to join. That's all I know. He just wants to join every time. <laughs> I, I still couldn't figure out how the farm sim guy messed it up. He was calling him Jost. Jost? <laughs> it's on the video. It's like Jost. And I was like, that's not how you say it. Anyway. Um, 
Okay, move There's on. A, yeah, none of them are for today because I made this list before the ones today came oh, out. Oh, good. There's nothing new for really today anyways. Yeah, fortunately, today was kind of... Eh. Yeah, it's this week's been kind of... Eh. Yeah. Um... <laughs> uh yeah uh one of the craziest mods that david's ever made um there's okay, things i've messed around this a little bit yeah and i kind of get it i'm kind of like okay yeah. well i could do all this kind of transporting stuff and things you okay there dj uh somebody was talking about blinking in the chat it's cool oh okay okay never mind don't worry i got the own star button up there i'll hit it and somebody will probably answer <laughs> I tr- I tried to order him nuggies and um, <laughs> I couldn't get his address. They they the, his his kidnappers wouldn't tell me. Yeah, so currently right now all I have is an IP address. It's not gonna do it. <laughs> it's not gonna do it. No, anyway, anyway, so there's there's stuff that this could do that David didn't even know it could do, and he made it. <laughs> oh, right. Like what? I don't remember. I just remember him saying something about it. Maybe he was just being nice. I'm not sure. <laughs> I, don't, I don't want to talk about it. Let's just say it was and move on. Okay. So um, you, you're just throwing that out there, and then you're giving us no stories on what it could, because now I want to test out what this you're talking about. You're, you're, not, not, you're, talking about. Call, you're not supposed to call me out when I say stuff out loud. You just say, That's kind of my oh. job on this show, I think, is to call you out when you say stuff out loud. You just say, ah, oh, cool, and we move on. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> is that yeah, it? Yeah, you do. Yeah, you got it. You got it. No, this, this, it's really, it's neat. You could use it as a tipper. You can put it in a a place that stuff accumulates, and then it'll accumulate in it. It'll hold up to two hundred thousand liters and weigh nothing. You can literally pick it up with your hands in the game, uh, with a little button on the side. Um, you can hook up to it with uh, classy hotel. Yo, it's fresh, but you can't tell because the Wi-Fi is terrible. Uh, the room's really nice. It was cheap though, so maybe that's that's why it's it's funny. At what the, you know, I'm, I am starting to figure out kind of. Yeah, all right, I get it. Let's move on. <laughs> <laughs> Moving along. Uh, uh, eighty-two studios. Well, you know, since you're like an eighty-two studio fanboy, I mean, we all are, but I mean, you take it to I, a new level. I have to admit, he he is a good friend of mine, and I do I do support what he does, and he does happen to be one of the best. I agree. So, all good things. I mean, how how many thumbnails were David's this week? <laughs> how many weren't? I don't know. Is that the better question? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, no. I want to. I want to go back now and look. I want to go back now and look. Can, can you can you pull up my can you pull up my my channel? Oh boy! <laughs> are we doing this now. Let's take a look. I Let's I do know well. that I do know that that I've got his palette. And at least one more thumbnail tomorrow. And it's in three thumbnails in a row. Um, here, yeah, here we go. Actually, let's, let's do it up a little bit. All right. So, um, okay. So there's one on the top row. I'm seeing one, two. I'm not. You, can go, you have to go back a little bit. I don't make that many videos. Come on now. Oh, one. Yeah. Uh, I don't know, maybe two, two, three. Oh crap! Uh, only three <laughs> on the top two rows. <laughs> Give me a little. Just a few in there. <laughs> I'm, I'm a solid eighty-two studio fanboy, and I. Yep. Yeah, I support yeah, you, Ben. I support you. Thanks, dog. Um. Anyway, what were we talking about? I don't know anymore. I've lost. I've lost. I got. I, I got. 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 I got this. I got this. Kubota, I dropped a membership. <laughs> uh, what you got? Hit me. And where is it? 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 Where oh, is his... it? Oh, that's right. He did have two mods on the list. There you go. Me. Yeah. Yeah. That's a great picture. There you go. Yeah. And this this is an eighty two studio mod as well. That's Pretty why I brought trailer. it up. <laughs> yeah, uh, it's awesome. Check it out. There you go. You got anything else to say about it? I really hadn't used it too much because he made it while I was gone. I think it's awesome. It's cool. Um, I mean, we did have a fifty three footer on yes, uh, um, third party sites. 
Okay. But they are, it tends to be like the, it seems to be like the, the, the ones that people just kind of start with. It's like their first mod to throw out there. And let's just say things don't quite work right on PC with these mods. So for those that are like mad that PC gets all these good mods right off the bat and like, oh, why don't we get these on console? Believe me, the, the 53-footer we originally had, I think that I had probably about like three months, four months ago, it wasn't good. Like you'd put it in the back and stuff would like fall through the walls. Um, it just didn't behave nice, right? So now you've got something that's for all platforms. So way better. Um, yeah. It's interesting because David used to do stuff for like third party and contract stuff and that kind of thing. Um, and I mean, he was incredible. He was one of the best then mm. um, working with Expendables and now strictly does Mod Hub over the last two years. Yeah. But he's brought that same level of quality. Super cool. I think his quality has gotten better uh, yeah. personally over the last the last two years. I mean, the stuff he did in 19 was great, but I think he's he's been able to step it up. Like you watch every truck that he releases and every piece of equipment, there's like a certain level of quality. He always seems to ratchet it up more and more. And you don't think there's possible for some of the stuff he does. So now, now look who's fanboying. Damn it. <laughs> Wasn't supposed to happen. Hey. Quit no no wordy dirds on my channel. Get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, let's see. Up next, this is an interesting one. The the next one on the list. This is really interesting because I this came out of nowhere. And it's a a fan favorite mod. Look at the ratings on this and the the star value on huh. this. I can't I don't remember what it was. Yeah, eight point, four point eight. eight. And it only came out what, two days ago? Uh, keep on the first. First, day, four days ago. Same thing, whatever. Uh, yo, it's done really well. It's just an old little tractor. Great detail. Kasten does a good job on all their stuff. Um, hmm. All their stuff is kind of old and rustic like this anyway. Mm -hmm. It's really good. And I think players are really happy about this. So, thumbs up all around. I mean, yeah, you're looking at this. It's a yeah, 30 horsepower tractor. So, it does what you're going to expect it to do, which is not a whole heck of a lot, but no, but they not do a have detail. Like looking at work with, yeah. looking at the uh, the cowling that lifts up for your your hood and everything. You've got tons of detail on all that stuff. That's kind of crazy, actually. It looks like the um, the damage um, on this one. It looks pretty good too. Like the just the the weird paint. That's always something that you never know what you're going to get. It seems like with some mods, what they what they wear like. You you're like, oh yeah, it looks great when it's brand new, and then. You drive it around for a couple days in game, and then all of a sudden you get the wear marks. You're like, ugh, this thing looks yeah. cool. like, like they didn't do a good job of this. They just this is like an afterthought. Yeah, that looks good. Does look good. Kasten is is one of those modders that has really stepped it up in twenty two. Um, they're doing great. And their mods are doing really well. I'm proud yeah. of. Them. What's next? What's next? I don't, remember, I don't remember what I put. Oh yeah, yo, this is another mod that kind of like took everybody by storm because they've got great ratings they've got a lot of ratings at that and they look awesome and you can yeah, see are, um i mean i've been following his stuff for a long time now but yeah. his mods are always so good too now he's gonna he went from mm -hmm. what like the um the seed hawk and to a bar mm -hmm. right and uh and now he's so he's gotten like very cool highly desirable equipment to yeah. buildings now as well Yep, and as far as I know, Let's these buildings out. are either on or going to be on um, Edgewater. Oh yeah, he's uh, got a couple other things. I, oh, I, and the Mac, of course, I forget about the Mac as well. Yeah, oh the killer mod. I I love that thing. Mm -hmm. This one took a little bit to get out. I remember there was like some trouble getting this thing out. Yeah, uh, and then at the, at the I use top it all the time right, now. You got, the, you got the silage balls that holds like what two hundred and sixty ish thousand liters. Um, well, he's released that as well. That's hard to forget. He's yeah. actually made that where there's no input, but it's only an output. So it's like having someone produce seeds for you. It's kind of yeah. cool. Anyways, I was uh, I I'm I'm impressed with the stuff he's got coming out for sure. Um, yeah. What up, Mikey? Okay, I was say, I'm like, where's the seed hawk? It's uh, it's up top. It's updated. That's right. It's got enough. Yeah. And then, like I said, the silage boss, which was a huge mod in seventeen for all yeah. platforms. He made that then. Yeah. So uh -huh. um, he's just killing it. Yeah. And he was in here a little while ago. Where you at, dude? My <laughs> at, yeah. Was he in here? I missed him if he was in here. It's my at BC Bueller. 
What's you okay over there? Are your, your, are your captors treating you all right? Man, I'm in a truck. Hang on, I'm going to... Did, did you like let one rip or something in there? Is that what's going nah. on? No, I just wanted to get some fresh air. Apparently, I've got the, the cold air circulating in here, and it's getting warm. <laughs> it feels like Wait, never road, mind. road warrior. What I do with the Go on, dude. I don't have that button. Yeah, I don't. I got. I can try to make the voice. You don't want to hear that. And, and you forget you miss Kubota's as well. Clutch is a cable oh. wrap on his RAM. I do not need any cable wraps on my phone RAM. Get out of here. Oh, Glenn. Oh, Glenn. <laughs> <laughs> I think he might have known. I think that's what's was there a, Are we talking about a crop duster now? Is that what that was? When you opened that window up? Yeah. No, that, that, was, that was not this. I would, well, I probably would have not been so obvious with it. But. <laughs> um, for, uh, the, uh, the dairy farm. Uh, oh, that's a bad picture. There we go. Uh, the farm, oh. sorry, the farm dairy, not dairy farm. Got it wrong. Yeah, the farm oh, from 4. Nine. Look at that. Yeah, it's got a cheaty version, and that's what it's called. <laughs> he said he made, named it a cheaty version because they wouldn't accept go ham version. <laughs> and I commented, I was like, we know what it is. We know, Disturbed is a, a friend of the channel. And when I saw cheaty, I was like, yeah, we know Who made this? Is. Disturbed. Nice. He's, okay. he, he does stuff with. Um, I saw the cheat. I saw the uh, cheat version. Agency. I didn't know that they, they, they was going to call it the Goham version originally. That's pretty I, funny. I I don't know if he actually was, but Should've. that's what he said. So you know, oh, I, we got to run like, with it, right? I'm running with it. You know, you know, Marcel's in chat right now. Going, that's not what the story was. <laughs> <laughs> Can we get that to pass next time, please? Though, so because um, like no cows. It's a dairy. It, it's a sell point. Uh, basically, it turns milk into other milk. What's up, Dash? Good to see Dash you. is in here. Hey, buddy. I, I check your, your page every day, man. Come on. Do something. I mean, do something. <laughs> it's like with the poking with the stick. Do yeah. something. I got the, uh, got the shed with the big DJ logo that's illuminated on the side. I love it. We need more. <laughs> yeah, I got to get going. <laughs> Well, yeah. Uh, Last but Stone not Valley. least, for all platforms, the update to Stone Valley. We already talked about this, but yeah, uh, it's a really good update. All the things that I had problems with, as far as deleting items in my Let's Play, have all been fixed. There you go. Cool. He did a good job with it. Pretty much, you can find whatever you want on the map and click it. If you own the land, you can probably delete it. I'm trying to think right now, but I think like I've had I had this question a couple of times about like what my recommendations are for North American maps right now for all platforms. I think Stone Valley might be number one. Stone Valley is number one. I think it's number one right now, guys. If you're looking for a North American map, you got to play Stone Valley. I I haven't done Let's Plays in how long, and I'm like I'm yeah. really enjoying this one. I did I did Let's Plays of this one. I didn't even have to this week, <laughs> and I got two more coming out this weekend. There you go. It's yeah, good. Looks good. It's a good map. Did you like pump the HDR up on this or something? That screenshot looks looks gravy. Look at that. I didn't have, I didn't have nothing to do with that, but that does look good. He uh -huh. did good job. So I mean, it's a Lancy boy. Come on now, you know I, he's good. Hey, I know. I'm just saying, man. I'm just, I'm just saying. <laughs> David, leave me alone. <laughs> Is he he missed, yeah, there we go. Yeah, he he missed the uh, the five minutes when we kind of geeked out and fanboyed over him in front of. Unfortunately, you, you can't you can't do it now. No, no, we've already got it out of our system. I don't need to fanboy over him for like another like no three weeks, two weeks, something like that. Five minutes. Um, PC only mods, PC Mac. <laughs> you wrote down the Iveco on here. What, Iveco. What's the situation with this? Uh, it was one of the only good things that came out from PC only this week. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's a nice truck and truck, but I, don't, I feel like we have a hundred of these already. No, that, no, that's. That's only our first one. No, but we got like the, the man, right? Oh, and yeah, yeah. we've well, got what else? There's another another box truck as well, European style. <laughs> Get out of here, eighty two. Um, yeah, I mean it's a yeah, but it's a little bit different. Plus, it's from Pepe. He does a good job. He does do a good job, and I guess I I can't complain because if I mean my thing, I guess it was like Peterbilt, and we had Mac, and we had uh, Kenworth yeah. trucks, and on this side, I'd be like, oh yeah, yeah, no, let's get more of these, and I'm like, I see Iveco and Man and Volvo and 
I'm like, oh, well, can we just get some more North American stuff? <laughs> yeah. The, I actually saw somebody uh, earlier today that commented and said, who cares about the Ivy Co? It sucks. Uh, go forward. And, and I just looked at it. I was like, you, you might not like it, but that doesn't mean that somebody else won't like it. While I was in That's Europe, you, you saw stuff like this everywhere. Yeah. It was are, this is huge in Europe, right? It was insane how much, like all the stuff. I was just looking out the window, going like, "This is all the stuff I talk smack about in Farm Sam. It's everywhere." And I mean, like the detail actually on the dash on these is pretty decent as well. Like it's been well modded. It's pretty cool. Anyways, it's just not something you're gonna do on a North American farm. That's all. And I can understand why some people in our sphere ends up complaining about it at times. But yeah, there's lots of people out there who want to use it. Uh, if we go like that, do we have enough maps? That's it. There we go. Exactly. We don't have enough maps. That's my point. Exactly. Look, one thing that I learned while being at Giants is I have the things that I like. Clutch has the things that he likes, which are totally different than the stuff that I play with usually. Oh. And, and then there's other people that have that stuff as well. The great thing is we're, we're a little bit biased sometimes towards one map versus the other. However, 100% Gi- Giants really aren't. There were stuff like the the first day that I was there, one of the guys that I'd never met before, uh, he was talking to me about the mods. He's like, "Yeah, like this is the this is the cool mod for the day." And I looked at, I was like, "Yeah, nobody cares about that. Nobody nobody cares about that mod." And he's like, "Huh?" So, but it it just showed me like they don't they're not being biased towards things. They're not picking on different modders or something. They want as many mods in the game as possible so that you can play with literally whatever you want. And and that's. That's tough to see sometimes for us, right? And I have that problem as well. Because I look at that and I'm like, well, I looked at all the mods that came out today and there's nothing. I mean, why why do they release these mods? No one no one wants to play with these, do they? Come on. Yeah. And then you oh, forget that. Much. We're such a small segment. Yeah, you see it all the time in the mod videos. I'm, you know, we have 20, 30 mods in a day. So they'll comment, you crap. <laughs> and it's like three maps and a couple tractors yeah. and all this stuff. I'm like, I thought that, I thought it was pretty good. Oh, we got stuff. <laughs> I'm realizing that the, the... there you go, Joe. Yeah, and uh, the, yeah, Taz says the same thing. <laughs> it's like, I don't like things neither. T-shirt clutch legs. Fair enough. And and you know what? It's easy for us to forget that at times because there's certain ways we like to play. And I think that that, that farming simulator does do that, right? Like there were certain it sends you down certain paths that really interest you. And there's just a thousand paths almost. And you kind of forget a little bit about some of the other paths at times, and then how popular they are with certain certain segments of the uh, of the uh, the demographic that play farm sim. And I'm I'm just as bad as anybody for that. I I have to admit. But you guys know where my um my loyalties lie. I guess there you go. There you go. No, look at that. Got a couple new members. What's up, dudes? Um, uh, where are we at? Yep. Oh, uh, Ren- Renabu. Actually, somebody said something. Uh, yeah, there you go. Right there. There you go. See, and that if you could do that, do it, please. I just, I'm not, I'm not that patient. <laughs> yeah. Which DLC you talk about, Mikey? Don't talk about my mom. It's like that legacy. <laughs> just because it's at a, like, like uh, I don't know if I want to say this or not, but I think it might be funny. So I'm going to try and branch out a little bit. So Legacy sent me a message the other morning. And I check Legacy's page every single day to see what they're doing and see if they've got anything coming out from on Hub. And and I hadn't looked yet, and I got a message from Legacy said, with their new things that hey, this is uh, this it's going to be going to Mod Hub. It's already been submitted. Uh, you know, here's the the building. It's first of its kind with this. You don't have to put in the video. I just wanted to let you know. And I'm looking, I'm like, how did he know I was getting ready to start working on the video? I was going to put him in there anyway, but now I'm curious. Well, you're in the video anyway. <laughs> yeah, him. He's like, that's, that's not what I meant. <laughs> <laughs> but it's really cool. So he's doing a, uh, he's got a, a video, or not a video, of a, a building. Sorry, I'm in the back of a car. Uh, he's got a, a building, and it's the first building ever in Farming Simulator to have a pressure washer and a, um, a thing to work on vehicles. Repair point. Trigger. Yeah. Yeah. Because before you've had to have one or the other and had to have it like dedicated, I guess, in the coding. Yep. And now they figured out how to make it both and to do it on all platforms. How cool is that? I didn't know that. That's deep. Hmm. Yeah. There you go. I didn't know you had to, had to wait for that. That's cool. Volvo. 
Bubble is cool. Uh, it's going to be really awesome. Uh, we are going to do some vlogging, and I'm thinking about contacting either uh, – either it's going to be bad. I'm thinking about contacting either FDR because it would be hilarious to watch them try to teach me how to do vlogging or uh, um, T-Bone or something like that because I know T-Bone as well. So Does I thought anybody be, have the patience for that? I thought it would be funny to do like a little like five to ten episode series of, you know, professional virtual logger teaches dj how to handle wood and um, that i'm like, <laughs> <laughs> i don't want to phrasing phrasing um because it does <laughs> I, 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 <laughs> correct me if i'm wrong here but i feel like the, the the peeps that are really big into logging and farm sim take it fairly seriously yeah like it's like you- there's not a lot of like I don't know. Let's take these logs and throw them at each other, type of things. It's more like, yeah, we got to properly stack this stuff and make it look real good. And like, it's all really about the simulation when it comes to logging. It seems like the people that do take it seriously, I just have a bad feeling that having you involved with any of that is going to lead to something that's going to end up with someone having a temper tantrum or maybe kicked off a server or I don't know. Close. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Close. Also, uh, heads up. Uh, my truck will turn off after an hour of idling. We're getting close. Okay. Oh, well, that'll be fun. <laughs> um, we can push so through that dis- pretty quickly then. So if I disappear. We need to talk about, uh, speaking of logging. Okay. Uh, Renaboo. Renaboo. Yeah, that's a cool map. Um, I'm not able to actually get it to run very well on my computer. Really? So, yeah, well, I'm running everything 4K, 200%, max settings, oh. et cetera, et cetera. I'm basically running what six k, yeah. more or less downscale. It runs pretty decent on mine, um, but it's once again like the thing we were just talking about. It's like okay, it's 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 primarily a logging focused map, and it's not really a region that I'm I'm interested in farming. I guess in that sense, but man, it's a it's a great looking map, and it, it has like a lot of there's a lot of detail put into that place, man. It's pretty cool. So Ola did a great job on this one. Um, yeah. All updated again um it seems like he's not stopping with this one hopefully there's some more i don't know if there's more updates planned but uh he's not there's a little change log right there you guys could check that out anyways very cool map if you haven't checked it out yet go check it out for sure because it's uh it's a beauty of a map for sure a lot going on with it uh-huh and the last one you've got uh mantrid's uh the engine starter yeah just engine starter at a gr- it's a neat mod it does more than just the engine start got a really good update and added even more features fixed a few things Check it out. It may be exactly what you're looking for on your map or in your game save in general. So I think this one actually gets rid of the, yeah, yeah. It gets rid of the engine starting little bumper. Oh. Front. Dude, that drives me crazy. Hang on. Hang Uh-oh. on. Oh, the hour's up. He's oh, just no. running. He's running. He's running. <laughs> There's people out here. Hang on a sec. This is going to be fun. <laughs> DJ's in a truck. Yeah. So just so you guys know, uh, more stuff to come. Oh, there you go. So Eric's even saying that uh, according to Ola, we got more stuff coming. I'm I'm all for it. I want to see more. Did you fix it? There are middle-aged people staring at me from the swimming pool. Oh, don't point the camera at that, please. <laughs> Not like that. Like, why did that guy get out of the back seat of a truck, get into the front seat, turn it on, shut the front door? And get back in the back seat. I'm surprised that your captors let you out of the back seat. <laughs> <laughs> Told uh, you it was gonna happen. Oh man, this is uh, hilarious. <laughs> well, you uh, saved it. I'm I'm impressed. I'm I'm just trying to be aware, that's all. Um a uh, couple things, a couple things surprised us. Me. Oh, what were those things? Do you remember? Can you see them right now? Hey, oh, you can boys see them. in here. What up? Lancey Barnes Lancey's out there. What up, dude? Good on, Lancey. Good to see you, buddy. Um, uh, well, I was surprised at how much I liked it. Like, it's it, it's a grapevine, but a greenhouse. But it gives you grapes, and you don't really have to do much. It's the lazy man's vineyard. I had an idea to take Stone Valley and make an entire field full of these. And then put out the the grape, um, the the pushy thing. Yeah. It just pushes like all of the the stuff to like the end, and then plop it into David's bag. <laughs> I don't know. I think I think I think it'd be kind of neat to try. 
basically you have like an entire area the size of a normal vineyard, but it's these. <laughs> it's like, yeah, I don't, I don't really feel like going through and harvesting this. So I'm just gonna let it do its thing. I, I hate to say this, but I don't think I've ever done a full grape harvest yet. <laughs> What's up, Lancey boy? Good to see you, man. Um, and lastly, I mean, I'm yeah! not surprised. I mean, this is so, like the quintessential so, tractor for farm sim right now. It is, but do you know who made this? I do, actually. The farming agency guys. <laughs> and they rebuilt it. Randy! Hey, Randy. Oh, I... I'm having... Get your, your fingers off of that. Hey, I can... Nope, not saying that. Uh, <laughs> I'm having issues installing Kubota DLC. You gotta do how to fix it. Um, giant support. There's guys here in the United States that are still working there today. They're still at work, so maybe they respond. I think normally they say 24 to 48 hours. Um, it depends, I guess, on what issues you're having. Is there any way you could be more specific? Because there is at least one or two people from Giants in the chat right now. Yeah, I would talk with them for sure. Uh, they get, yeah, are you trying to download from Steam? Are you trying to download from Giants themselves? So you get it from Epic? Like, it all depends on where you're downloading it from as well, too. So, do whatever, uh, yeah, I mean, there could be a, a hundred things that are just not happening. Hopefully, uh, just... I'm freaking really? Massy. <laughs> it's killing me tonight. Um, oh, man. I hate to hear that, though. I hope everything gets sorted out, and I hope you're able to figure it out so you can play with it this weekend, because it's a really cool DLC. Yeah, talk to Giants. They'll, they'll sort you out. Yeah. So, you're at a music festival this weekend. I am, yep. Uh, actually, it starts in 30 minutes. So, and I'm, I don't know, is there I'm any like, bands that anybody's going to know about in here? Is it like any big names? No, no. Yeah. Lord, Lord, no. <laughs> no, this okay. is a small, small town music festival that was originally created, I think, like somewhere between five and ten years ago to revamp and like redo a theater that was uh, downtown. And it was called a thing. I don't want to say what it is because I don't want people to know where I am this weekend because I'm on vacation. <laughs> um, and uh, and like in the first couple of years, they were able to do that and they were able to pay for 100% of the uh, it kind of redoing the, the theater, which is really cool, but they've continued to do it every year. So they've picked different charities and things like that to give all the money to. And when yeah. I did it, there was like, I don't know, three to 400 people, something like that. Okay. Um that that went to it and i was able to handle that with my equipment handle bands and stuff like that i'd worked with this the the host band for quite a few years um but after well after covid and everything uh the what was it 2019 i think was the last year that i didn't do it they had over a thousand people there it's huge uh so it's gonna be interesting that's but awesome. i'm excited i'm a, I'm a yeah I'm a VIP. So I, I got me a lawn chair. And it's got pistons in the back of it, and it's a rocking chair, an outdoor <laughs> rocking chair. And I, I got, oh, and I got this is a, is a clip-on cup holder because it doesn't have a cup holder. <laughs> so, and it's got a phone holder too. Is that what that is? Yeah, yeah, yeah. My phone fits perfectly in there. The, the funny thing is, I'll tell you what this is supposed to be for after, after I show you. But like, my phone fits in there even with a case on it. I got. Is it a bicycle mount? Is that what that is? It is not a bicycle mount. Try again. I'll show it to you. And it, it rotates. Okay. Does a good job rotating. Chat, what I, do you guys not, think? I thought it was a bicycle mount. I did not bring my vlogging setup. No. I did bring my GoPro vlogging setup, the one that I used in Europe, but I did not bring the new one. No. There's, no. Uh, I'm here to enjoy myself, not carry around a four pound stick. <clears throat> just missing a fanny pack. Actually, that would have been a better idea. Uh, I, I will. It's it's for strollers. Is that what it's for? Stro <laughs> Were you like wandering around the kids section and you found it or what? No, no. I, I, put the, uh, <laughs> I went on Amazon and I was like, all right, I need, I need a, uh, I need a, a, a cup holder, and I just put, put like clip on cup holder, and it was one of the first ones that Amazon recommended. And I, and I was looking at it, and I was looking at the clip. I was like, 
That'll clip onto the thing. Okay. If that was for Mrs. Clutch, it'd be a wine glass holder. That's all. They it was really funny. Um, the in the video for this, they showed all different kinds of cups going in and out of it on the stroller and everything. And it was so funny because the last one was a very very popular um, uh, beverage with a red label, a big red label, and it was a 24 ounce. And he's just like, this manly hand just shoved it in. <laughs> and I was, like, I was like, all right, well, they know they know who's buying that. I'm not sure that should be connected to a baby stroller, but that is pretty funny. And they sold it. <laughs> I don't know um, if you got a coupon, any coupons for diapers with it or not, but that might be beneficial for you. I'm not saying you can't use the code DJ Gohan, but if you do, it may work. It may not. Oh. So I think I might actually go visit with, um, I think Austin Farmer's in town. No way. This week. So he's at like a truck show, he was saying. So I might have to go, uh, I'm going to have to go source him down here in Calgary. And I told him, I'm supposed to go hang out. That's what I heard. I don't know. We'll see. It happened on Sunday. Okay. I might be going to see a certain police officer farmer. Ooh, that's year. awesome. Make sure you to say hi for me. To be fair, I asked you what you were doing, and you said you had to work. I do. But he has to work as well, but he offered to ride along. And you can't Ooh. do that at your job, so I'm going to do that. I'm going to go for a ride along on my birthday. I'm, I'm a little jealous. That'd be fun. <laughs> so the only thing is I'm not sure I could take a, a, a selfie cam with me and just do you could do like the uh, the cops song. You could do that the whole time. Be like, bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? What you gonna do? <laughs> when you get these I'm not gonna be happy. <laughs> you know what? If it, oh, if we if we get hit on farms and show, man, whatever. You can, you know, that we're just thankful that we've got really good sponsors for the the show that really take care of us. I'm really grateful. Uh, so thank you, Giants, for letting us use code DJ Goham and Clutch Sim. Uh, when you buy Farming Simulator. And if you guys want a G Portal Serval, uh, you should buy the first one with code uh, KSIMS or whatever yours is. Um, what's your, that is what's your G Portal? Is it? I think it's KSIMS. <laughs> I don't even think there's a code. I think you should use the link, don't you? Yeah, I, but think... there's, I, don't, I don't know. Mine's, mine's like a da, 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 slash. I think it's anyway, KSIMS. Like, I think you get like 10% off right now on G Portal Serval. You do get 10% off. Mine's, I think it's KSIMS. I'd have to double check, but I'm pretty sure it's KSIMS, but it's a linky cool. link as well. Or DJ Gohan. Uh, or DJ anyway, Gohan, if uh, you really want to use that. Yeah. Uh, and uh, some, probably something about Raid Shadow Legends. I don't know. I, I, I don't oh! know if I can do. I got something. Oh, no. Here we go. I, I went full shill yesterday morning. On what? Do you know what product a certain huge tech youtuber who's located in canada released yesterday morning oh is this is this the thing you posted on twitter yeah did he respond to you by chance no but yeah, attacked him so. on purpose <laughs> and it attacked him on purpose but it doesn't show on my page <laughs> so you have to go actually look i, uh, I saw it <laughs> country bumpkin leave me alone i'm working um Anyway, I got a Linus Tech Tips backpack. Okay, is it just? I I, I do. I, I'm, I am kind of curious. Is it actually like a decent backpack, or is it just a know. garbage I, piece of merch? I do. I hope not, because it was expensive. Um, so I I was looking at it. The more and more I saw, I was like, I could have really used this bag if it does exactly what he says it does. When I was in Europe, like I would have. I said, you know, you said they were like, man, I'd pay for that. I did. Um, yeah, the LTT backpacks. I've got it. I'm going to do an unboxing of it. I'm going to show me loading everything in. Richard's unfortunately correct there. Um, but I'm going to do the whole the whole thing uh, and, because I want to see if it really <laughs> worth it. Uh, and I plan on getting a screwdriver as well because I can no, really no, no. Was it was it really? Was it that much? Was it two hundred and fifty bucks? It was. It was that much, and I got a. I got a water bottle to go along with it. <laughs> it was. It was after shipping. It was over three. But okay, so my laptop bag I bought a few years back, and I thought I yeah. overpaid. It was like sixty bucks, but yeah. it's like a Targus waterproof high-end right. laptop bag. Yeah. What does this? 
laptop ba- I, is this like is this not... is this your girlfriend now <laughs> uh, <laughs> look it's a it's a write-off and i'm gonna see if it's any good okay all right, all right. whatever so uh I, I love i love their channel i love what they do and they i do. Could care less about wearing their t-shirts and stuff but this is something that could potentially be extremely beneficial for me especially um, with as much as I am and could be traveling soon. So, Fair enough. You can't argue with that. Like, I could have used it this weekend. All I needed was like one pair of shorts and a pair of pants and like a t-shirt and all of my computer stuff. So. so. <laughs> uh, anyway, so we'll see. Uh, we'll see. I'm hoping it said three to nine day shipping, but I was in wave number two and I don't know when those are happening we'll find out you're crazy dude we'll see all right just let me know how it is maybe send me one when you buy an extra one Mm, extra extra (laughs) that hurt it hurt (laughs) (laughs) maybe maybe for christmas and your birthday (laughs) i'm okay with that (laughs) no wonder i don't think he got he doesn't wear those anyways 82 who you kidding Oh, why is the, the mat in the back of my truck all caddy corner? What has happened back here? <laughs> well, I think it's time we should let you out of the back of the truck, but um, are we Appreciate good next it. week? Are we doing this next week? I don't know what I'm doing tomorrow. Actually, I do yeah. know what I'm doing tomorrow. I can't even say that. Um, what are we doing what is next week? Maybe we do Find it next out. week. If you're, if you're, I think I'm around next week. So That, that would be uh, August the 12th. Okay, I don't know what that means, but okay. Uh, it's just next, next Friday. There, there ain't anything on my schedule. I got yeah. a dentist appointment on Wednesday. That's going to suck. Yeah, I still got like a broken tooth I need to fix too, but that's all right. Um, so next week we'll plan to be here again. Hopefully we won't have Goham stolen. Maybe his captors will let him go and uh, <laughs> we can have the farm some show in a normal kind of fashion. I don't know. We on I guess my channel. I don't I don't I don't know how this counts anymore, but we're going to do that. Um, make sure you guys subscribe yep. to us. Uh DJ Goham and Clutch Simulations. And then, of course, we're on podcast, the Farm Sim Show on podcast format. If you haven't checked it already, go check it out. Links below. Uh, Put them in, everyone. Maybe next week we'll get you some nuggies, DJ. We'll see. Maybe, I, oh, it would have been funny to get you nuggies in the back of your truck. That would have been perfect. No? Okay. Anyways, uh, thanks <laughs> for hanging out with us, folks. We will see you guys next truck. week. Maybe I should have always had a golden opportunity. I could have gone through the drive through Oh, well. I'm, I'm, I'm having dinner downtown tonight, so whatever. <laughs> Form some show? Normal? What? Uh, it never happens, right? It's not a thing. Um, yeah. Thanks for watching, folks. Uh, make sure you subscribe where you need to subscribe, and we'll see you guys next week. Um, go play some Farm Sim. Have a good weekend, guys. Stay safe. Bye, go ham. <laughs> Buddies! Holy crap. Banana <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> Don't move. 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 Are you making fun of me now? Really? Is that what you're doing? Are you making fun of me? 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 Are you making fun